Happy New Year! My name's Jason Debley, and the whiskey, the first whiskey of 2018 to review, is an Irish pot still whiskey entitled Writer's Tears. If you've been reading some James Joyce, maybe you should have this to drink along with your great novel. Writer's Tears is produced by an independent bottler, that, and that independent bottler is the Walsh Distillery Limited. The Walsh Distillery Limited is owned by the Walsh family, and they also produce the Irishman. Writer's Tears is 40% alcohol by volume, E150 artificial color is added, but it's non-chill filtered, there's no age statement on this whiskey. Wood management is in X bourbon casks. This is an Irish whiskey, so it's triple distilled. It's a pure pot still whiskey, which means that it's a combination of malted and unmalted barley, mashed together, and then uh, triple distilled, as I said before. The uh, source of some of the spirit comes from Middleton. And the rest, uh, the malt, comes from bush mills. On the nose, it's sweet. There's honey, buttercups, vanilla. There's some oak. And a slight menthol note. Kind of characteristic of the pot still style of Ireland. So the pot still spirits from Middleton, the malts are from Bush Mills. What does it taste like? Undiluted, this is a light whiskey. It's honeyed, obviously it's sweet, milk chocolate. Underneath, there's a bed of ginger, but slight ginger that's never biting or offensive. There's some oak. It's a delight. This whiskey, when I first opened it, it, uh, it got better once there was some oxidation happening, which is you open the cap, you pour yourself a drink, you come back to it a week later with the cap back on, and that oxygen reaction with the spirit has improved it. When I first tasted it, when the bottle, when the cap came off, the pot still distinctive flavor was quite more pronounced, but with a bit of oxidation became even better. On the finish, you're left with ginger, green apple, a slight eucalyptus note. This is a really good balanced whiskey. There's nothing offensive here. The price is attractive and it's a young whiskey with no flaws. It's well balanced, it's clean, refreshing, and smooth. I strongly encourage you to try this whiskey. Cheers, take care, and have a happy new year.